Hello everybody, Ikamalam Dinga Sinotando, Gram Kiza and welcome to my YouTube channel. Well, as you can tell from the title of this video, I am addressing the why and how I ended up on YouTube. Okay, so the thing is, nah, I think a small part of me always knew that I would end up on YouTube, but a big part of me was like there is no way i'm ever gonna join youtube i'm not going into youtube no oh no i don't know i don't have what it takes i don't have the equipment where would i even start yeah so a big part of me was like no this is not gonna happen and um but what would happen is i would make these diary sessions these story times and these vlogs on my phone all the time like e gallery um, has so many videos of me saying welcome to my youtube channel welcome to my youtube channel and me talking and being like oh guys this uh guys that so that has always been something that's happening i think yeah and i think i would tell myself no i'm only doing this because you know there's this hype around youtube and no i don't really want to be a youtuber and then until this one day i was watching my regular youtube content right and then kwa suggest a video by katherine manning Shout out to Catherine Manning. <laughs> Not that you're watching this video, but hey. Um, Catherine Manning. And it was talking about starting a YouTube channel in 2020, Beginner's Guide. So I clicked onto it. Um, you know, I've watched several YouTube YouTube videos about starting a YouTube channel. I don't know, it just only is tickled my fancy. So I'm watching Catherine Manning and she's talking and she's talking, yakulum, 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 yakulum. And the thing about Catherine is that um her things are very tutorial style so she'd have like a screen recording of her screen as she goes into youtube studio and it was the first time i'm seeing youtube studio i'm like oh this is what the other half sees by the other half i mean the people that put out the videos i'm like oh, this is what you guys see on your screen when you're putting out a video this is so cool so catherine was like showing instructions of, of how to get to youtube studios and what it what all the different buttons mean and all the cool functions are. So as she was giving the tutorial, I, I, I was doing it on my PC, right? So I'm doing it on my PC. I actually have a video of myself doing this. <laughs> I was taking a video of myself doing this. It was part of my vlogs that stayed in my gallery. It was part of those things. So... So I take, um, I'm, I'm following Catherine, I'm following Catherine, I'm like, okay, you click here, you click here, I'm like, oh, this is what my YouTube studio looks like, and then I'm like, and then she shows how to upload a video, and I'm like, oh, let me do that, so I go there, I upload a video, and then I see, some video, you can make a video remain private, which means only the people that you want to see the video can see the video, I hope that English makes sense. I wonder about Funai about my bony video, I was a bony video basically. Hi, okay. Then I'm like, okay, cool, you can do this. So I go into the, the, the videos in my laptop, I pick a random video, which happened to be a video of Anati and I. Anati is my bestie, Anati and I. And then um, I upload it, and then I click the private option, right? Because they ask you, do you want it to be private, unlisted, or whatever. I, I click on private. And then it's loading. Then I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh my word, this is YouTube. YouTube, guys. I was so, oh, I was so psyched. Then, okay, I load, I load, guys. Which takes forever. YouTubers out there, they know what it takes forever. I, and then when it's done, I am looking at my video on YouTube. And I'm like, this is sick. This is crazy. This is not okay. And I'm like, my video is on YouTube. Granted, only I could see it. But I then I decide, okay, let me send the link of the video to my friends, right? So I send the link of, of the video to my friends. You know, the yellows. And probably about like five people. I'm like, guys, I just uploaded my very first YouTube video. I was playing around and I did that. And then they 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 watched the YouTube video and man jumps air to hey my friends think I'm serious. And I was playing around, Nina. Man just they think I'm serious. Losing and pella and pella, I'm starting a YouTube channel. I and then and then when I hear my friends get all psyched about it, I'm like, very, very why? Why? 
why am I not studying this thing? Because obviously I want to do it. But the fear keeps getting in the way and telling me that, no, you don't want to do this. No, you don't want to do this. And I convince myself that I don't want to do it because of the fear. But really, I do want to do it. Then this, this, by the way, happened on the 19th of August, right? So I'm talking to Anati and the bestie. And I'm like, I could do this. I could really do this. And she's like, yes, babes, you could do this. It wasn't on the 19th of August that I decided that I want to start a YouTube channel, but it, it's definitely where it all started. But I was like, it's very important that I answer the important questions before I start this. I need to ask myself, why am I doing this? And what is it that I hope to achieve with this YouTube channel? Because I was like, I am not going to do this unless I have the why. Um, because then if I do that, it will just be following the hype of YouTube channel. I mean, of starting a YouTube channel, that. So I took a couple of days to really think about my why before I decided that, okay, I'm doing this. And I think what ended up being my why is, Ubana, ever since, like my friends and I always talk about this, about how crazy it has been ever since we left home. Like ever since we, we matriculated and we went to university, you know, how crazy a journey it's been, how rapid, what's the proper English word, or how fast the growth has been since we left home. It's crazy. We are literally different people every week. Like it's a running joke that we are not even the same person every week. And I think that... Um, I really want to start this channel to document my ongoing life journey, to document the lessons, to document the realizations and the confusions, the ups and the downs and the feeling lost and going through it, going through it all together with you guys that are watching my YouTube channel and um, just to let everyone who's going through this growth spirit, is it called a growth spirit? I don't know, this growth part of our lives, to know that you're not alone. You are not alone. We are all out here trying to figure it out. Oh, yeah, another big thing is, Mana, you really don't have to have it all figured out. You don't have to have it all figured out at once. All the things come to you one by one as you grow, as you go through life. So I think that's basically why I would want to start this YouTube channel and what do I hope to achieve with it. Like I said, I hope to create a sense of community with everybody else who is going through the same thing that I'm going through. And also just to let you know, Mana Babes, you're not alone. There's something about the human condition that really thrives from knowing that you are not alone, from knowing that many have gone through what you're going through. Many are still to go through what we are going through and many most importantly are going through what you're going through with you so that's why i'm here which brings me to the name of the channel the name of the channel is blooming and i think it's 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 very it's self-telling it tells what it means it means blooming like a flower that blooms and becomes a beautiful flower um this is a time when we are blooming the growth that we're going through, it is a time when we're blooming and the results of this bloom will be something um, magnificent, amazing and beautiful. Right. But here's where the catch started. Here's where the fear came from. Here's where the self-doubt came from. It came from, yeah, I know I have this why and I know that I want to start this YouTube channel. But in order for me to actually have the courage to start, I have to believe that there is a place for my voice in this world. And I think that's one of the hardest things to actually believe about yourself. But I remember this ad by Nomzamo. Nomzamo. Eh? Nomzamo. Where she says that um, she approaches life boldly. With the surety that in this big, big world. There is a place. There is a space for her little voice too. Is it her little voice? No, there is a little space for her voice. Yes. Um, just believing that, no, really, there's a place for you as well. I know that I really struggle with that, especially when I see amazing things that are being done by so many amazing people. It gets, it, it, it makes me question myself, Ubana, what, 
could I possibly add? What value could I possibly add to other people's lives? Um, what have I gone through that could make me qualified to add any sort of value to anyone's life? But I think really believing that in this big, big world, because it's quite big, there is there is a little place for your voice. There's a little place for my voice. And when I was scrolling through Instagram the other day, I saw this quote, guys, for the love of me, I cannot find it, but I will paraphrase it. It, um, it basically says, Mana, in order for you to take up space, you actually have to believe that there is space that only you can fill up. You see that one? So the day you believe that, that's the day the self-doubts and everything is going to fly out the window. Because no matter how big a space anybody else is filling, no matter what anyone else is doing, it I kapazeli the space that you are supposed to fill. Because at the end of the day, only you can fill that space. So I think that those are some of the things, or that's the biggest thing that I've had to overcome in order to actually get myself to start this YouTube channel. It's to believe that I do have something to say. There is place for my voice. And there is a space that only I can fill. Apa and Klabin. So, um, yeah, not to say I'm already there. It is a journey of getting there. And starting this YouTube channel is definitely testament of the steps that I have already taken. And it is a step forward in this journey that that I am going through. But just because I'm here and I'm talking and I'm actually starting to upload videos and such. It doesn't mean I've gotten over my fears. Not even close. That is literally me. Like, start. Start whilst you are still shaking. Dim lower, guys. I am starting this and I am so scared. Every time before I have to... um, Every time. It's only the second time. Before I have to record a video, I get so scared. I start freaking out because i'm like oh my gosh what am i gonna say i'm gonna forget my words i'm gonna start over and many other things that are in my head which brings me to my next video because you guys will be waiting for my next video right my next video will be talking more about the fears that i have about starting this youtube channel share that with you guys so that you guys can see but i know man go rough man if you've come this far guys and you haven't subscribed please do the right thing subscribe and if you really like the content do share do leave a comment down below and like thank you also one more thing people have cool names for their supports um for their support from from the people that listen to your to their content right you know there's shokenge from shujuletwa there's dicho me there's honeys with y'alls i think i want one i definitely want one i know my support is still very small but you guys you guys you guys came through for me and i think i want one and from a nazi suggestion i think i want to go with bloomers Bloomers, because what are we doing? We are blooming. That's what we're doing, right? So, if you guys hate it, let me know. Then I'm just gonna change it. But, but I mean, bloomers, bloomers. And then I'm like, okay, um, I've, I've, yeah. <laughs> and then 